Hi everybody, this is John from Envision Robotics. Thanks for tuning in. You're probably wondering why I have a DJI Robomaster turned up on its side. Well, if you're watching this video, it's probably because you have a stuck ejection button, just like I did. Um, we uh, we uh, were using the unit out on a baseball diamond in the fall. A lot of dust and dirt got kicked up and uh, got into the ejection button area. It stuck, my battery wouldn't stay in, so I reached out to a local uh, seller of DJI drones and um, uh, Robomasters and other equipment that they have there, and they said, well, bring it in, we'll do a diagnostic. And I thought to myself, you know what, I'll do a little video for everybody and help you save some money. So here's what you need to do. So, and, and I took off the battery um, cover here, and I took it off because it was a little bit easier to, uh, to record. But first thing you need to do, and it's fairly easy, so you can actually um, do this just with a couple of tools. You need just a uh, Allen wrench here, the right size. Uh, but first, you're going to take off the wheel. I've already taken it off to make it a little bit easier. So you take that off first, and then you come around to the top of the unit, and over here is another little screw. So you take that one off next, and then what you're going to do is you're going to swing around to the bottom of the unit, and there's two more screws to be taken off. Those three screws help to hold in the motor, okay? So I'm just swinging back over here there. and Take this off here, boom, pretty easy, right? Okay, I've got that off now. Now I'm just gonna pull out the battery here just for a moment. But next thing you need to do is you take your finger and you reach back in, because it's, and you push it in and out. Now you can use a vacuum, you can use uh, something to blow some air. I use a little rag as well with some Windex. But what you're trying to do is just make sure that you get any dust, dirt, other debris un, uh, unstuck from the ejection button. Make sure to try it. There we go. Looks like it's worked a little bit better here. Boom. Push it in again. You can see though that in some case I still need to work a little bit more that there probably is a little bit of dust and debris still into in there. And so after I've done this video, I'm gonna continue to clean a little bit more, but I wanted to show you how to do it there. Perfect, okay, so now make sure um, when you're taking it apart to put all the screws in the right spot um, so that you don't uh, forget where they go. Um, it's not that hard to do. You can do it at home. It's a great way to save some money. So again, this is all about getting your um, battery ejection button unstuck. If you've enjoyed this video, please share it with friends. Give it a like. We love comments. And of course, we love subscribers. Thanks very much. Make sure to check out our other videos.